Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So I'm actually starting to do my makeup now and I thought well, why not film a little bit today because today is a big, big day. I'm actually getting ready really quick to go sign my papers for my new house. Yay! I was literally so excited last night that I couldn't even freaking sleep. <laughs> it's like a little kid the day before Christmas, you know? And I honestly feel like I'm just excited because I've been waiting for this for so long. And now that it's finally here, I'm like, dude, what? But yeah, I really couldn't sleep last night at all. So I literally woke up this morning at like five. <laughs> and I was so bored, but I was like, might as well be productive. So I actually like went to the gym. <laughs> went to the gym this morning, super early. I got home and did a little stuff that I needed to do and then I got in the shower and now I have to get ready in like 20 minutes signing is like at 10 and it's currently like literally like 9 10 so I kind of have to hurry just a little bit I still have to like go to the bank and make a cashier's check for like the cash to close and of course i'm never simple so my bank i only there's literally only two of my banks here in albuquerque so i had to drive all the way across town to do that so kind of in a rush right now i didn't think i was gonna be running late and i'm not really running late i'm just maybe i'm just like anxious you know or like excited or i don't know i did want to bring you guys along with me though because Nobody can be with me today for my signing. <laughs> my sister can't be with me because she's like um, taking like a training or a class or I don't know what she's doing. Something for work, I think. And then my parents obviously don't live here. So it's literally just going to be little old me. <laughs> just me and my realtor, which I know very well, but still. It's always nice to have somebody with you, you know? <laughs> and I want to share this experience with someone, even if it's over the internet so and if you've seen any of my other videos i feel like i've explained it i don't know how many times that it has been literally so exciting building up to this because when i say it's been a roller coaster to get here i i, I really do mean it i mean like emotions you know like finances <laughs> and like mental health you know like literally everything it's been such a roller coaster to get to this point i feel like experiencing it like this is just so much different than what it would have been like if I would have, you know, obviously gone down another path. But I know a lot of people that like live with their siblings and they absolutely fucking hate it. And it's like dreadful for them. But for me and Shy, it's like never been that way. I feel like me and Shy are literally like best friends. We're as close as two sisters can possibly be. And like our lifestyles are very, very similar, you know, like we both like to like kind of eat the same foods. We're both like obviously clean in the same type of way. We both have like the same type of lifestyle. Me and Shy are just like two peas in a pod. We're just like the same thing. So there's never really any issues with me and, and Shy. I think like we get under each other's nerves at times, but like I don't think it's ever turned into like a huge blowout fight to where like we just hate each other, you know what I mean? And honestly, like this whole situation wouldn't even have been like possible without Shy because obviously I've been like staying at her house for the last year and four months, which was honestly a blessing, especially now for inflation because like my rent with Shy was cheap as fuck, you know what I mean? <laughs> so I was able to just like save money, still be able to like do things I wanted to do. And honestly, like if I, wouldn't have been living here and been paying like an actual like what eleven twelve hundred dollar rent every month i don't think i would be in this position right now so thanks to my sister shout out to my sister i think even leading up to this moment a lot of people were telling me like not to buy a house because obviously like the interest rates are fucking insane right now but you know what i said to those people I said, I don't care. I'm still going to buy a house because one, I want my own place. And two, if the interest rates are going to go down, they're probably not going to go down for like another, what, year and a half, two years. I ain't about that life. I'm not going to wait another year and a half, two years. Like, no, not going to happen. And honestly, like in my opinion, I don't think we're really like doing much to help like the interest rates right now. I mean, 
not even just the interest rates, but like anything, like the groceries have like doubled in price and that's fucking insane to me because I used to pay like what four dollars for some eggs how the hell am I paying twelve dollars now what can somebody please explain that because that math ain't math in right now so yeah I just wanted I wanted to buy a house so that's what I fucking did I think if you're thinking about buying a house just fucking do it fuck what everybody else is saying I think it's the smartest thing to do because one it's gonna be your own spot and two if you're renting you're literally paying like what you would be paying for a mortgage maybe a couple hundred dollars less but like I'm telling you right now if I can do it you can do it I said what I said. Had to get dressed real quick. But yeah, I really do think it's like the smartest thing to do. Unless, of course, you have money to buy like a duplex or like a fourplex or something like that. Like definitely do that. That's obviously like a way better investment than buying like a single family home. I'm literally running like so behind right now. <laughs> but it's okay. It's okay. This stuff ain't no joke. Running late, always running late. I always, always, always take a hair tie with me and a clip with me because I just don't know, you know, what kind of vibe I'm gonna be in. <laughs> and it changes throughout the day, you know? We need some color to these lips. Okay, I think we're ready to go. All right guys, so I got the cashier's check. We're ready to go, we're ready to close. I'm running. I was running so late. I don't know why I always do that to myself. I don't know why. I don't know. I'm literally going to pull up at like 9.59, this says. And closing is at 10, so. Is that late? You guys can see all my shit in my back seat. Don't judge me. <laughs> That's what I did this morning when I got home from the gym. Is I kind of just packed up my car with just like little things that I have um, to take to the house once I get the keys. Since I had to move back in with my sister, just all of my stuff has just been like on one side of her garage. <laughs> so like literally all my shit, like my table, my couch, my bed, my everything, every little thing that I had besides my clothes, obviously, and my dresser, that's really all that I have like in the room that I stay in at her house. So. I just packed my car with some little things that I could just take over there. Lots of cleaning supplies though because I gotta clean the house obviously before we move in. So yeah, I will see you guys once I got them keys in my hands. <laughs> Sorry guys, so what had happened was <laughs> I went to go pick up my microwave, I went to the post office and then I came back here and they had a cute little surprise for me when I got back here and then I just unloaded all the stuff from my car. So I'm in my house right now. I don't know if you guys can hear the echo, it's only me in here. Yeah, I'm just gonna spend the day cleaning and stuff. I was gonna do like an empty house tour now, but I think I'll just, I think I'll just wait. <laughs> I gotta go get that. All right, guys, this is how we're ending out the video right here. This is my girl, Anissa. You guys have seen her in a video before. She helped me perm hey my hair, but she brought me a little gift. She brought me my favorite, which is tequila, tequila. of course, our ratchet ass lime. Because <laughs> we, we, nice. we don't have silverware yet. And she also brought me some cupcakes. Yummy. And she got me some flowers. She just brought all the goods. She brought all the goods. She knows. She knows. We're gonna celebrate. <laughs> so that is it for this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And I will catch you guys in the next one, which is gonna be a empty house tour. So see you then. Bye.